Hey, what's up, guys? It's your man, Foriam again, back with a new guide for Avatar, Frontiers of Pandora. Today, I'm going to walk you through the Eye of Ewa questline, which can be pretty tricky to complete, especially if you're still struggling to get your hands on Swamp Hive Nectar for the Kingler's Queen ritual, as this can be extremely confusing. So in this guide, I'm going to help you with everything you need to know about it to basically prepare for the next quest, getting your hands on your own Ikran. So let's get right to it to it. All right, so the first thing you're going to have to do for this quest line is go to the Aranahe clan home, home tree in the middle of the Silk Woods, where you will meet Etua on the first floor. And after talking with him, you also want to meet Nefika right outside home tree, who will ask you to gather Swamp Hive Nectar for the Kingler's Queen ritual. In the beginning of this quest line, everything doesn't seem all that problematic, as your objective will be highlighted pretty easily as long as you use your Navi powers. But these will basically bring you to a location where you have to deal with an RDA gas extraction site. This is because the surrounded area where you can pick up this type of resource is polluted. So this means you first have to clear the camp, then you can start gathering these resources again. Anyways, the sabotaging part of this quest is pretty straightforward. You just have to interact with three different things inside, which sabotage it entirely, and then nature will restore its full glory in the area. So when all the pollution is gone, you can continue to gathering the Swamp Hive Nectar again. Unfortunately, this time you won't be able to find its exact location anymore, even when using Navi powers. This can be extremely confusing, so let me quickly show you where you need to be exactly. So if we open up the Hunter's Guides, go to Wildlife, you have to go for the Swamp Hive. You want to pin this one, most commonly found in the Swamp Lowlands biome, or the Silk Woods, inside the King Lore Forest. I assume many of you guys toggled the biomes and searched in this specific area for a very long time, including me, which was, well, unfortunately, not successful. If we zoom out and toggle the regular map, you can see that this is the Silk Woods and that is the Stone Blade Ridge. You have to focus on this boundary right here. It's very important that you stay within this area. Right below the Sunshine Valley Lab or only a couple meters to the west of the Gas Harvester Alpha. So if we quick travel to this location and look at the RDA facility, wow, this I think is one of the cool things about Avatar Frontiers of Pandora is that um, now this will basically look abandoned. Nature has been restored in the area, but we still have a lamp working right here. Anyways, what you want to do right now is open up the biomes once again and check out the Swamp Lowlands biome. So a little bit northwest, I would say, walk to this pretty big tree as right behind it, you should be able to find some of these hives or nests. So if you use your Navi powers, see, we can already inspect this right here, Swamp Hive. So this is what you want to gather. So now we have a pristine harvested during the day and this is a fine quality. We've got another one right here. Just hold and pull up basically to easily get a pristine harvest on them. There we go. And there is a fourth one right here as well. I only got my hands on fine quality ingredients this time, but as long as you keep harvesting these, skipping time, you'll be able to find plenty more. If I open up the map, this is where we are at this very small island location. But now you can travel to the Glade of Lights and continue your quest. Talk to Etua and Nefika at the very top of it, which triggers another quest where you have to fly around with Moth. And at the very end of it, you need to interact with the tree one more time to complete the quest entirely. So there you have it, everything you need to know to complete the Eye of Ewa quest line. Especially gathering the Swamp Hive Nectar can be extremely confusing, so that is the main reason why I made this video. I'm sure many of you are gonna save hours with it, as man, I spent a lot of time searching for these items. Ladies and gentlemen, a big thanks for watching. Be sure to hit that like button if you found this video helpful. You have no idea how much you help out the channel with it. And yeah, be sure to subscribe if you want to stay in the loop with future guides related to Avatar, Frontiers of Pandora, and many more games. Guys, have an awesome day. I'll check you in the next video or live stream. Take care. Peace.